I'm joined right now by Clay Bavor at Google, VP of Product Management, and who's helping to create stuff like this thing. This, Clay, what the heck is it? It's a bunch of GoPros on a tripod that takes pictures all at once, yep. everything around you, or even shoots video that yep. way? So that's what we call a jump camera. And okay. today what we announced is something called Jump, which is a set of technologies, including a camera, but also some software and then a player that lets anyone capture an experience or an event and then share it in a way that others, anyone, can experience as if they're stepping into the video that all around them but, but, in virtual but reality. But it is 3D. It's virtual in, in the way that it captures. So if I were to describe this to someone listening or something, I would say it's like, a, like part of a wedding cake with cameras stuck all around it. Sure, you can call it a wedding cake made of cameras. Uh, and what it does is capture 16 viewpoints of that the scene. That would really tick off a lot of brides, I think. <laughs> I don't think they'd be very happy, no. Um, it captures 16 viewpoints, and then a bunch of software that we've written that runs in the Google Cloud actually takes those 16 viewpoints and turns them into thousands of viewpoints, all the way around the circumference of the, the camera array. And we can then turn those viewpoints into the final product, VR video. That again, you can step that aside with this of, cardboard look device, and you stick your phone in the back of this piece of cardboard with a couple of cheap lenses yep. on it. All of a sudden, you have this experience of seeing things in, in three dimensions. That's right. So cardboard, it's just a piece of cardboard with some lenses, and you assemble it, and then put your smartphone in it, and it turns your smartphone into a fully functional VR viewer. And so when you view jump content in cardboard. It's stereo, as in three-dimensional, and you can look all around you. It really just feels like you're there. And it does. I was showing some, looking at some stuff here. Yeah. It's, it's really cool. You went to Iceland and to Japan. In this case, I was standing in the middle of a, tra of a, of a, of a track or something. A bunch of cars were skidding yep, all around yep, me. Yeah, that's cool, too. So talk to me. Like, let's go much bigger picture in yeah. Google. So what does this mean for the business of Google? How does this help Google garner revenues? How does this help Android be more relevant? Sure. But Google from the beginning has been about organizing the world's information and making it universally accessible and useful. And we really think of this as a very natural extension of that. Capturing the world's places, events, important moments in history, and organizing them in a way that anyone, anywhere, can experience for all time. And we think there's something important and special in that. So I see this very much aligned with the core of what Google does. So is it, is it, that being information, the experience of being in a place That's at a right. certain time, capturing that information, with this wedding cake of cameras, That's right? And then what? Like, where where does the revenue happen? Where, where do I hear the cash register in the yeah. store? Yeah. yeah. You know, so, as with every Google product or most Google products, we've started like we did with Search, like we did with Maps, with YouTube, just getting the product right, getting the user experience right. And then we assume that we'll figure out how to build a business out of it later. Right now, the technology is so new, we're really just focused on making a great user experience, a great product, and we assume that we'll be able to figure out how to build a business. And all these people, the people crowded, the people crowding into our shot, but the people, the people crowding into this event, there are people trying to figure out what a business case for these things, partnerships they want to strike with yeah. Google, devices, they, the hardware they might want to make for Google. Well, this is just so new. It, the, the approach that we're taking here is fundamentally different and more advanced than anything that, that we're aware of. And the results, the quality of the imagery is just so impressive. So I think many people have just been shocked by just how high quality, how vividly the jump video, jump VR video can put you someplace else. Near things are near, far things are far, you can look all around. And I think that the, the businesses, the potential use cases for that are many. Uh, one of the other things we uh, announced today we call Expeditions, which enables teachers to take their classes on field trips to anywhere. That's a trip, and the, and the way it's captured, of course, is, the, is maybe one of the biggest obstacles. Maybe you saw some of that. Clay, very right. cool stuff, very cool stuff from Google out of the Google I.O. conference here in San Francisco.